Hey you guys, it's Shandera. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe to the channel. So in today's video, I try skin 1004 for 15 days. Now I know I say in the video is skin 10004. Please forgive me. It's skin 1004. <laughs> Grammar community, please don't trick me. I am sorry. So let's go ahead and see what these products are working with. So I'm just gonna use just a little bit. I mean, this is so creamy. Oh my God, the water is in my eye. Can you guys see? The water is really in my eye. Oh my, oh, oh wait, I can use euphorisms. <laughs> Y'all, the water was hurting, I really tried. <laughs> Now we're going to go ahead and move into Tony, and I just love the fact that their whole entire line like literally matches. <laughs> um, I'm using a little reusable cotton round so we can save the environment one step at a time. <laughs> no, no disrespect to the earth or the environment. I'm just saying, look, y'all. I'm just saying, you know, I'm just slaying the little messy skincare community. You know, they always talk about saving the environment, but then turn around and selling products that aren't saving the environment. This toner is very gentle. Let me get behind my ears. Um, it's not burning at all. It's just a very gentle toner. Like this whole line is just so gentle. So as I'm applying the serum, it's not giving me sticky vibes at all. Just honestly feels like it's sinking into my skin really, really nicely. Um, I'm not gonna let the serum dry down. I'm just gonna go ahead and go in with their uh, soothing cream. Um, let's get a swatch of this. Oh my God, you guys, that looks just like honey. Get, honey, come through, honey. <laughs> oh my God, I am so excited to put this on my face, honey. I'm not wasting this product. It's going straight to the face. Oh my God, a little bit goes a long way. But y'all know I love to apply extra. <laughs> This is what my skin looks like after a four-step skincare routine. What do you guys think? Y'all know I'm used to doing about 10, 20, 80 steps. So this would be something new. What do you guys think? So you guys, I've been testing a lot of sunscreens this week. And this one gave me kind of a purplish white cast. <laughs> so you see my face is nice and wet. We're gonna apply some of the Madagascar Sentinella Foam from 1004. This is how much I use. I just rub it into my face just like this. So I'm gonna try to get my lips because for some odd reason, I've been having a lot of sunscreen on my lips. You can literally feel the sunscreen dissolving off of your skin. And this is what it looks like. What do you guys think? It is just so gentle. What do you guys think? It got literally all the sunscreen off. There is no need for double cleansing when it comes to this cleanser. Every time after I've been using a sunscreen, I keep my face just damp and then I go straight to using the toner, the serum, and the moisturizer and my skin feels so nice. So, so far, so good with Skin 10 4 The soothing cream is definitely keeping my skin very hydrated and moisturized, less inflamed, especially right now because I'm having a a lot of texture it's getting really dry here so my face normally gets very very irritated when the wind starts blowing and I get this weird texture as you can see but thanks to the soothing cream my skin has been very very hydrated okay look <laughs> I know this look look a mess and I just want to say this uh, me and Sonomi were playing in makeup well she got into my good makeup and I had to do a a woo to calm down and I say you know what let's just do some makeup so she came up with this botched look <laughs> you know how when you try to do your makeup and your child come up and say oh let me put some right here and you're like oh maybe it'll look good and then here we are it don't look good <laughs> We're just gonna go ahead and wash it off with the Skin Tim 04's Madagascar Sentinella Foam. And we're just going to see how amazing this cleanser works. Do I need to double cleanse? Will it cleanse all this makeup off? I mean, I got a full face of foundation, eyeshadow, the real thick eyeliner, and a concealer that I was trying to do and Sonomi just ruined. My face is wet, here's the cleanser. 
we're about to put this baby on our face. So I'm noticing that the makeup is dissolving so easily. I haven't got my eyes yet, but I will say this. My eyes are not irritating as I'm getting really close to my eyes with the foaming cleanser. So I really like how my eyes are not burning. I'm not screaming and you guys see me rubbing the cleanser on my lids, uh, eyelids. So I'm gonna go ahead and rinse my face and we'll see how much of the makeup can came off. There is virtually no makeup on my face, not even my eyelashes. Can you guys see my eyelashes? <laughs> There's like no makeup anywhere. This cleanser is amazing. So I have a cotton round and here's the toner. I'm using it. Here we go. And I'm applying the toner just like this. No makeup. Let me turn the light down so you guys can see. No makeup. That cleanser is no joke. Let me get behind. Well, probably the sides, because I didn't get the sides too well, so it'd be a little makeup on the sides. Yeah, it's just a little on the sides, because I didn't get it too well. But the rest of my face is completely clean. So today, I didn't use the cleanser. I just rinsed my face with warm water because I kind of wanted to see how moisturizing the products were. And I'm just gonna apply a little bit of toner. Um, I've been using a cotton pad as well. I actually like using my hands with the essence. Um, it wastes less product. Um, sometimes I'll like do like that so I don't waste a lot of product with using the essence um, and my inflammation has calmed down a lot now I add the serum the serum is very hydrating but not uh, it doesn't weigh me down so I really love applying the serum I actually apply two layers <laughs> you know I love a good a uh, serum now it's time to apply the soothing cream now i just use just a little bit i've been still using a little bit this much it's literally like you're applying a hydrating honey to your face this soothing cream is so hydrating it's not greasy i love this moisturizer so much it gives me that glass look this is what my skin's been looking like what do you guys think oh Ooh, ooh, and this is just first thing in the morning. Girl, this is the perfect start to a good day. <laughs> <laughs> so here are my final thoughts. I really enjoy this line. I'm going to start off by talking about the cleanser first. If you have sensitive skin, dry skin, it will not strip your skin. It's not irritating, but it cleanses the skin really, really well, as you guys see. This is almost like a hydrating cleanser, but it's not a hydrating cleanser. I've never experienced a cleanser where it cleansed your skin without completely stripping it of any oils. And this cleanser really did that without being a hydrating cleanser. This is a really great cleanser and it's very, very gentle. I really, really enjoyed the toner. The toner is very hydrating. However, I will say this, if you have any type of pimples or open wounds on your skin, it will give you some sort of stinging and burning sensation. If you have any type of residue for makeup, sunscreen, it will cleanse it as well. But I love to use this as a toner and an essence because it works well with any type of serum you're using it really sets nicely on the skin this serum made my skin very very hydrated it actually gave me this beautiful glow after the fifth day I was pleasantly surprised also I noticed when I come home and I'm doing my nighttime routine and I use this serum it really calms down a lot of the irritation I'm getting on my skin from wind burn and when I was having breakouts it was one of the serums I could use with my breakouts where I didn't need to spot treat. If I'm having a breakout, I'll normally spot treat with something else and then use a serum all over my face. I was able to use this serum all over my face without it irritating any of the breakouts I was having. Let's talk about the soothing cream. This is almost like a very, very hydrating gel cream. Moisturizer sort of gives you like a very glowy glass look and it keeps your face very hydrated. So when you're you're in the process of applying your last layer which is sunscreen it makes it so easy to apply sunscreen even the botched sunscreens honey it's like a water gel but creamier 
thicker like honey I really don't know how to describe it but it's really amazing it doesn't flake on you it doesn't pill on you you don't get that jelly filling it works well with a ton of skincare it's just a really great just amazing moisturizer and it just soothes the skin <laughs> That being said, you guys, those are all my final thoughts on the Madagascar Centella line that I tried for 15 days. I want to thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you thumbs up this video. Make sure you're following me on all my social media sites. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you in our next video. Bye, you guys. Mwah.